Hi guys, welcome back to my channel, my lovely Scorpio. So this is going to be your daily reading guys for your general energies and also for your love energy Scorpios. So first I'll be taking cards for your general energies and then we'll be moving on to your love energies Scorpios. What is coming up for your general energies guys Scorpios? First we have the three of pentacles. We have the Nine of Cups. We have the Two of Pentacles. Wow, guys. We also have the King of Wands. So, what I'm getting here with these cards is that Scorpios, today you will be very, very creative or your creative side will be working more than your practical okay so you won't be much practical today you won't view things in a logical way you will like to be more creative and you will be more focused on your imagination and your creativity okay and even like you might be very very into some kind of a psychic uh, you can also be a tarot reader you can also come to know about your psyche powers guys for some of you that is what i'm getting here so i also see here with the nine of cups that you guys are definitely working towards improving yourself constantly it can be like you're improving you're starting to improve a business or you're starting to improve yourself it can be like you're paying more attention to your health okay it doesn't necessarily have to be like uh, something that so that is what i'm getting here guys and with the two of pentacles here i see here that you're conflicted between two decisions that you have to make so if you find yourself in this conflicted energy it is not going to be like this forever guys okay so just take, just make a decision in your love life because i see here that some of you you're not able to make a decision because you just feel like it would harm you or you just feel like if you make a decision it will not be enough so or this person will get hurt you're scared of the other person who's involved in this connection you're not just scared about yourself but also about with this person guys okay so that is what i'm getting here and with the three of pentacles you definitely have to work hard for to achieve so you've been lazy all along you've been like not lazy but you've not been concentrating on your work much or something like that scorpio so today is a day why you will start concentrating more on your work or start concentrating more on your personal growth or whatever it is okay so that is what i'm getting here for your general energies guys i'll now take for your love energies and we'll see what's coming up for your love energies my lovely scorpios so for your love energies guys i'll be using the power of love cards what is coming up for your love energies Okay guys, if you can see we have the spontaneity card. Make sure that you are communicating to this person much. Because I see that for some of you this relationship lacks communication or there is no proper communication between you both. Maybe you both are so happy with each other, you're talking really well and suddenly maybe they stop talking to you or suddenly they don't talk to you anymore. And this can um, be the reason that you're feeling a little bit dull because this person is very nice to you, they're very kind to you. Um, they're like the dream person that you always wanted and all of a sudden this person goes blank they're not talking to you about anything they're not expressing their feelings and that kind of a sad energy okay so you are uh, kind of panicking you're sad that uh, this person doesn't care for you or you have a lot of negative uh, feeling about this relationship 
coming up because this person is not communicating to you all of a sudden okay and you're even thinking that they're going to leave you they're not going to stay with you so also with a willingness card guys i see that you are supposed to do what you're supposed to do if you feel like being with this person is not necessary if you feel like you have to stay alone or if you feel like do whatever you feel like doing trust your intuition because for some of you i see this is not a spiritual connection this is not um twin flame or soulmate connection i think i've told this earlier uh, if you are dealing with um taurus virgo capricorn then it is not i it is a spiritual connection guys if you're dealing with the aries leo sagittarius or a scorpio cancer pisces it is a combat okay we have the forgiveness so your person mostly wants to ask you for their forgiveness and they want to make this happen guys they're trying to make this relationship happen they want to to have this union with you because i see here that this person yes they've made certain mistakes and they're in that realization process okay for most of them they're in that realization process they're very happy to have you in their life because you are always there for them you always there you are always doing whatever you have to to stay in this committed relationship with them this is making them feel so special they feel so happy and they feel so excited to have you in their life is what i'm getting here guys i'll just take one more card and i'll be reading some tarot cards over your again to kind of find out what's going on in detail for your situation guys okay and we have the priorities make sure to prioritize yourselves guys because i see here that some of you are not prioritizing yourself maybe you're so concerned about this person you love this person too much yes i understand it's not it's okay to love someone too much guys but you have to always prioritize yourselves you have to always think about yourself more like think about yourself improving yourself and making sure that you're okay before you care about others like okay in the sense like you have good food to eat you have like the necessities that you need to i i mean maintain yourself to maintain yourself and prioritize yourself first because you need to have some kind of a self love built in you to kind of like give out love okay so make sure that you love yourself and do the work because i see here for some of you scorpios that you are so very insecure that you're not in love with yourself you are obviously you are in love with this person but just because of this person guys you shouldn't change you should change for yourself okay so that is what i'm getting here because for some of you scorpios you're changing because you feel like you need to change for this person the change should come within you for yourself not for someone else okay so let us get more cards and the clarify was coming up detail then i'm going to leave you guys if you're really sad that this person is going to leave you even though it's been like years it's been months since this person spoke to you they're not going to leave you is what i'm getting here okay for most of you that is the case but for some of you if this person is uh, suddenly stop communicating with you that they way the way that they would always communicate then you don't have to worry okay because i see here that some of you are really worried you don't know what to do you're very upset because of this person that they were so good to you they were communicating well but suddenly they stopped communicating it's because of their own energy guys if you're dealing with a pisces this does happen so it's according to their zodiac and what their characteristics are okay and it's not only because of your energy so you don't have to really worry about your energies and you don't have to worry if this person is not communicating to you or if they're not calling or texting you often okay is okay and also don't make the first move guys because i see here that this person will view you obviously scorpios you're a sign who is really very very mysterious yes that is a mysterious energy and this mysterious energy is what um that brings people that attracts people to you guys okay so just it's okay if you're mysterious it's okay if you don't call first it's okay if you don't text first doesn't it's not going anything is not going to happen okay so just leave 
just be free and don't think a lot don't be so clingy nothing is going to happen okay so you don't have to be the person who's going to always communicate you was always going to text and always going to call no let this person do the work okay because i think here that mostly for some of you guys like this person is not done it was not committed into the into this relationship more or they were not committed but i see here that they will be committed into this relationship after this because they kind of value you or they're starting to value this relationship okay so thank you all so much for watching guys my lovely scorpios bye guys see you all tomorrow this is all